music with Sarah. All right, babe. This is your song of the week. And uh, hopefully people are encouraged by all your songs of the week. Hopefully. There's a lot of good songs. So, I mean, I hope people listen and check them out. If all they right. Don't know, so but... this one is uh, um, Christ, Our Hope in Life and Death, which is the one that we are showing today is actually performed by Shane and Shane. It is. Um, it was done by Keith and Kristen Getty and Matt Papa in 2020 originally. And there are many versions out there, and I'm sure they're all good. But my favorite is the one on the Worship Initiative, Volume, volume 20. 20. Yeah, so he's got Shane a lot of volumes out there. But uh, this is the, the Shane and Shane version. And um, so anyway, why do you like this one? Well, I think the title pretty much says it all. Christ, our hope in life and death. And so that is the point of the song is that he is our hope. Right. And I know recently we did a show about hope. And I think that's a huge thing in the life of a Christian, not only in death, because in, in death we hope for what's to come right. with heaven, but he's also our hope in this life. And I feel like when we understand what he has to offer, not just for the afterlife, but for the here and now, it's amazing. Yeah, so absolutely. So it's very exciting. And so that's that's what it talks about is what our hope is. And the second verse says, what truth can calm the troubled soul? What truth is that? That God is good. Mm -hmm. And, you know, sometimes it's easy to think God is good when things go our way and when we get the raise and when our right. kid does get better and whatever. But God is good no matter what happens. Right, and right. Good or bad in our perspective, God is always good. So what he does is good, right? And that is that's a good thing to remind us. Even if a house floods, or yeah. a house burns down, or we lose our job, or a loved one dies, you yeah. know, God is still good. Yep. Yeah. And later on in the verse, it says, "Who holds our faith when fears arise?" And oftentimes in this life, when we do face those difficult times, fears arise. But mm -hmm. we have. A firm foundation. We have an anchor. We He holds our faith when fears arise. And then it says, the last part of that verse says, who sends the waves that bring us nigh unto the shore, the rock of Christ. Mm -hmm. And I just, I don't know, I think that's a an amazing picture. You know, it's like he sends the waves and like he, he does have all power mm -hmm. and he's able to do whatever. But oftentimes the things that we do face are used to bring us closer to him and so right. that we'll draw near to him. Right. Absolutely. So, Anyway, it's it's a great song, and obviously it ends with the, the last final verse is, Unto the grave, what shall we sing? Christ he lives, Christ he, Christ he lives. Right, and right. the picture is, we meet him one day. And so that Absolutely. is the ultimate hope, is meeting him face to face and being in heaven with him. That's so, it. That's so, it. Yeah. So that is Worship Initiative, Volume 20. You can look that up, Shane and Shane. Yeah. Um, or you can you can find the, the original Christian. Yeah, they're all Kristen good. And but Keith if you, Getty. But if you haven't heard their version, you really should go check it out because sure. they, they do a pretty cool job.